In this video, I'm gonna teach you how to play Team Fortress 2 with a controller. It's a very quick and easy process, so make sure to follow along. You are going to be able to play Team Fortress 2 with any controller that you have, even generic ones, as long as you run the game through Steam. What you have to do to properly set up and use any controller to play Team Fortress 2 on Steam is to first go to your library, click on Team Fortress 2, and make sure that your controller is connected to your PC. I'm gonna skip over this step because I'm going to assume that you already have it connected. You can use a cable, a wired connection, or just do it wirelessly. As long as your controller is being detected, detected by your computer, you will find this icon at the right side of Team Fortress 2. For now, don't click this. Go into the settings icon instead and then select properties. Now, go into the controller properties and in here you have to make sure that Steam input is enabled for all controllers. Basically, Steam input is what is going to automatically set up to help us use any controller that we have on Team Fortress 2. So make sure that it is enabled and you can also click the controller general settings to double check. In here you can enable Steam input for individual controllers. After this is all enabled and your controller is properly detected and verified, you can now go ahead and click the little gamepad icon that I mentioned. In here you can browse through all of the layouts for Team Fortress 2. Basically, when you connect a controller, a layout is going to get applied. As you can see, Valve has an official layout for this generic Xbox controller that I'm using, which means that all the keys will be automatically attached for me, but you can also go into Edit Layout and change them individually over here to your online. Liking. Like I said, any controller that you are using is going to get detected, a layout is going to get applied, and you can change these as necessary. You can browse through community-made layouts if you wish, and as long as you have, have a layout active with Steam input enabled, the next time you run the game, everything will be automatically set up. So as you can see, immediately I can already press A to continue. Like I said, Steam input makes this process super simple because it sets everything up for us. I don't know all the controls out of the top of my head, but as you can see, everything is working. I have never played Team Fortress 2 using a controller, so this is definitely a cool experience for me. I'm just going to use my mouse to close down these menus, but as soon as you learn all the controls, you are going to be able to play Team Fortress 2 solely using any controller that you have. I hope I was able to help you on how to play Team Fortress 2 with a controller. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more quick and easy tips. Thank you for watching.